Hey everyone, in this cloud native Prisma Cloud demo video, you will experience an overview of our comprehensive cloud code security capabilities. Now I'm going to start with our policy screen. In our policy screen, you can see all of our build and runtime policies. You can filter down by multiple different categories or types. Here you can see I've filtered down to just the build policies. You can also see that I've added in custom policies. Any custom policy you add here will show up in all of your code scanning across all of your integrations. Now these policies are across many of the popular frameworks such as Terraform, ARM, CloudFormation, Kubernetes, Helm charts, Docker files, etc. They're also across all three of the major cloud providers, AWS, Azure, GCP, and Kubernetes. Now I'm going to jump into Chekhov, which is our open source tool that underpins many of these capabilities. I can scan an entire directory or file for all the different policy violations that it has. So if I open up this, if I do a Chekhov scan of this EC2 Terraform file, you can see all the different violations I have, like ensure default security for every VPC restricts all traffic, and that S3 buckets have public access blocked. And up at the top, you can see a nice summary of all the past and failed checks that I have. At the next stage of the uh, software development lifecycle, I have my IDE. Here you can see what it looks like when we integrate with our IDE. It looks like a spell checker where it will show me all the different violations that I have for policy violations, as well as custom policies that I have. I can also do a quick fix where I can either generate a skip command that skips that specific policy for that specific resource block, or I can apply a quick fix. Applying a quick fix automatically adds in the code that will automatically fix the policy violation that I had. The next integration I wanted to show off was our VCS integration. Now we integrate with many of the popular VCSs across GitHub, GitLab, Bitbucket, and Azure repos. And every time you open up a pull request with our integration turned on, uh, Prisma Cloud will automatically generate bot comments about the misconfigurations that you've introduced. And it's only for the code that is relevant for that pull request. So you can see here, this resource block does not have encryption turned on. And it's a high severity issue. If I open this up, I can see a description, more relevant benchmarks, any dependent resources, as well as for some of these resource policy violations, I can even see the code that it would take to fix that policy violation. And I can automatically commit that to fix the policy. Scrolling down to the bottom here, you can see some of our other integrations with CI CD platforms as well as our uh, GitHub application. Now, opening this up will bring us back to the Prisma Cloud platform in the code page. And this code page is a central place where you can see all of your violations, all the posture of all your code across all your different repos and all your different scans. So you can see some of my Circle CI and CLI scans, as well as my GitHub scans here. And you can see here, I'm in a, my branch right now that, to update that S3 bucket uh, Terraform file, but I can always move back to the master branch to see all the different vulnerabilities and misconfigurations in this specific repo. And you can see here, I have all of those same misconfigurations that I found in that one pull request, along with all the others for the all the repo. And for many of these, I can generate a fix, which opens up a pull request to fix that misconfiguration. I can filter by category, severity, tags, or whether or not it has a fix. You can also search or use get blame data. So if I just wanted to see the misconfigurations that were introduced by uh, by Barack, I can click on Barack and see just his misconfigurations. 
Now, one other thing I wanted to point out here is we do have smart fixes. So these the fixes that we have are both static fixes for things that are uh, single fixes that will fix all misconfigurations of that type. We also generate smart fixes, which are fixes based on secure coding practices you've had in your own repos. So you can see this fix is based on 60% of passing policies. So this policy violation where my ACL grants read permissions to everyone was fixed by removing this public read line in 60% of my passing policy checks. So I can also open up a pull request for that smart fix. The last thing I want to show is our repositories. So I can show you a quick overview of all the different integrations we have. Adding a repository, you can see here's all our code repositories we integrate with, our CI CD systems, as well as the IDEs we integrate with. Additionally, we have our part of Prisma Cloud Central Alerting. So if you want to open up alerts to Splunk or Jira or Slack, you can do that through Prisma Cloud about any code misconfiguration you might have. And that's our Prisma Cloud demo of our cloud code security capabilities. Thanks for watching.